Hi guys, welcome back. I am Red Z, and today we are playing the US in Victoria 3. Fantastic. Last time, we basically tried to expand our economy quite significantly, which we have done, because I believe we started around 30 million, and now we're on 42. You can see it going up. Our standard of living's uh, staying about the same. Our radicals are going up. Our loyalists are uh, kind of going up. Um, but we're trying to do the reconstruction. And I don't think we're going to do it in the time, honestly. It's, we get too many bad events about this. Um, I'm glad that none of these have rebelled yet. Because it, it just allows us to... Uh... Oh, wait. Uh, that's... <laughs> uh, literally just as I said that, bro. Anyone going to join? Tina, Chile. I mean, Britain might join them just to cut us down to size. But I'm hoping not. We'll uh, defend and then advance this front. And you, with your two whole battalions, defend and advance this front. This is one kind. This is quite good actually, because if we look at this state, it's not got twenty. It's only got twenty-five thousand, but this one's got sixty thousand. But there's plenty we can uh, like. We can get a lot of immigration down here. And the Andes, yeah, the Andes is, is not a great trait. Uh, but there's plenty we can do down here. Take this. So therefore, the rest of our colonies will be uh, colonizing a little bit quicker. Uh, because there's not those colonies anymore, if that makes sense. Uh, how are we colonizing over here? Still a thousand days. It's so long, bro. Yeah, it's still so long. What about our declared interests? We've got... Yeah, we'll declare there as well. And then let's have a look. Can we... That It'll take a, a month to declare them. We'll have a look at back in a little bit. Ha! Ah, everything's going quite well, though. Apart from this horrific border gore. We need to get the... Uh, we need to get Texas up to 30. God damn, Redeemers. Go away. Uh, that should help. Yeah, I don't think we're going to do this. I think we're just going to spend the timer out. And that should hopefully sort out our situation. Get us some more migration. How's New York doing population-wise? Yeah, people are leaving New York. It's probably yeah, a lot of turmoil here. That'll be why. Uh, from radical population. Yeah, we need to make you all happy. How many peasants are there? There's only 20k peasants here. So I thought you'd be a little bit happier because your standard of living would be okay, right? Yeah, your standard of living is not too bad, guys. The peasants are struggling, but apart from that, everyone else is, is, is okay. Guaranteed liberties. That should help. Surely that's going to make that go down. Surely. It says. Less radicals. Raising concerns. Yeah, I'll make the industrial slightly more unhappy. Because whatever. God damn. This reconstruction needs to end. <laughs> it needs to end. <laughs> oh. uh, no, we don't want to say fair yet. Um... Could go for the dedicated police force. I mean, it's a it's pretty popular all around. Yeah, minus 10% ra uh, radicals. Minus 30% state penalties from turmoil. Sounds good to me. Sounds good to me. How's our institution coming along? Oh, we have it enacted now. Fantastic. So these places should be colonizing. Yeah, a lot quicker now. Probably about 800 days or so. Oh, they just back down down here. Chile has this little spot, which is a bit annoying. But apart from that, that's fine. They just back down. Um, yeah, we can't establish any more colonies down here. Okay. Denmark. Oh, yeah, 86 days. Bro. We're hopping in on this then. If we can. Yeah, we can't go into Gambia. That's still 800 days. That's a lot quicker than I was expecting down there. 
Cannot reach the state. Oh, because France and the Netherlands have blocked it off. As long as we're quicker than the Netherlands, we should hopefully block them off. Now that we've got really fast colonization. Also, Guinea as well. That would be good to get up to into Futajalan in this area. Obviously, over here now is a bit of a problem because Britain are going to come across that way. But this is really where I'm banking. We're going to be making some making some money with our colonization. Yep, that's fine. Um, yeah, where's the low market access? Gambia. Let's build a port. And then Sonora. Build a port. American Togo. Let's build a port. And then Niger Delta. will again build a port. <laughs> and New York. Not a huge amount of access. Two more ports. And then we'll also build a railway. That should fix that. Got a few buildings queued though. Oh, God damn it. Redeemers. Fine. Ah. It's tough. It's tough. <laughs> Reconstruction is, is hell right now. It's absolute hell. Anything we could do here. I don't want the, the planters to have more. I mean, home affairs we could. I think we go for that. How much uh, bureaucracy will it take? 49 weeks for that to be done anyway. That's cool. How are we looking on the journal? Urbanize. 75% uh, of states have an urban center that's equal to 5. Um, oh, well. <laughs> yes, we got him. Ten percent authority. Thank you. How are we doing on this now? Forty-six out of fifty-seven. Ugh. The more states we have, the worse it becomes. <laughs> Nightmare. Nightmare. Unable to fully hire because we don't have anyone with populate uh, with the. Yeah, with the uh, the qualifications. That's unfortunate, but oh well. Yeah, we're going to do this really quickly. We've also taken Togo really quickly as well. Now, it's a bit annoying that these are so much slower, though. Why are they so much slower? These ones over here were really quick. Can I not establish a colony over here? We must have an interest. I do, don't I? Yeah, there. I thought I did that. Also go there as well. We can, if we can get to these areas before Britain and France, that will be huge for us. Because this is there's a lot of population in here. We go to some of these states. Maybe not this one, per se, but some of these. 700,000 in Cuba. 500,000 there. Yes, a lot of population that can go into factories. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's quite a lot. And we will accept them culturally as well, which will be fantastic. So they shouldn't be so upset uh, when we take over. <laughs> Still 28.9 in for me now. So we can start to think about taking some other stuff. Reconciliation, whatever. 47 out of 57. Come on, we're slowly building up. Loyalists have gone up quite a bit recently, actually. And the uh, radicals have gone down. Likely because of co uh, standard of living increases. How are we doing for our market now? I've just finished building a load more textile manufacturing. Uh, clothes manufactories. Okay, remember lead was a problem. Lead and steel. Two issues we have. So let's queue up those buildings. Resources, lead mines. We actually have a couple, but not many. Queue up seven. And, sorry, what was it? Gold mines as well. We should finish that off. Um, yeah, let's do that. Um, sorry, what was it that we needed? When I went to the budget there. Clothes still. 
Lead. We still need more steel. So, let's go for... Uh, somewhere we've not built in, really. Go for somewhere like Arkansas. Uh, let's go for Missouri. They've got a lot of... Um, a lot of people in there. Put the tent. And then, let's have a look. How are our tools doing? Because we're going to have to keep having a look back at that. Yeah, we're getting close to the edge now. So, we will build some more tooling workshops. Build four in New York. And then, other buildings-wise. Obviously, just more textile mills. We're having a major issue with textiles. With clothes. Who's got a lot of... Let's just go for the amount of peasants. No peasants in the District of Columbia. <laughs> oh, Pennsylvania. 18. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. I mean, we build pretty quickly now. So I'm not too bothered about jigging around how they do it. Um, yeah, I'm fine with uh, the order. Because we build, we build quite quickly. Yeah, it's, it's going to take a while, but it'll be fine. Yeah, now, see, we get we start getting a lot of uh, population. So, Afro-Caribbeano people are going to Massachusetts. So, you can see, 160k migration, bro. That is a lot. That is a lot. Because of the multiculturalism, because they're getting discriminated against in the Caribbean, they have come here, which is great for us. Ah. Uh, okay, what's this? Released patients from the Washington Asylum have steadily denounced the practices involved in their supposedly medical treatments, mistreatments of the sick, withholding of personal letters, and disproportionate punishments were among the charges. Oh, that would be good, actually. That would actually be good. It's only going to cost us 11000 for a little bit, so that's fine. More of these events, bro. Nightmare. 48 out of 57. If we can slowly get that up. I mean, we've only got three years, so I, I doubt it, honestly. Look at our market again. Yeah, massive d lack of lead. I think we need to import some clothes and fabric, ideally. So, clothes. Oh, 37. Is that it? 37. There's no... I mean, we'll do it, but it's not worth it. <laughs> it's not going to do anything. Fabric. Anywhere with fabric. I'm hoping China will be able to sell us some fabric. Let's have a look. Uh, oh. It's not much, is it? But we'll, we'll, we'll take what we can right now. Take what we can. <laughs> That'll alleviate it, like, pretty much not at all, but a little bit. Oh, come on, Texas. Why have you gone down to nine? I thought you were on, like, 17 before. To a maximum of 50, but I don't know how much we've done already. It doesn't tell you. Yeah, whatever. Got an embargo. Mexico's embargoing us. Liberia's our protectorate. Indian Territory's our puppet. I could have sworn that normally the Indian Territory gets absorbed easily. Uh, 48 now, that's good. Well, maybe it'll all come at once. If we get the loyalists up. Radicals have kind of topped out now. Uh, ish. They're starting to go back up again, which is a bit annoying. Okay, the Ute uprising. It's fine, it's these guys. Shouldn't be much. Uh... Uh, let's recruit another general. Shouldn't be much problem to deal with. Recruit a general in... The Niger HQ gets 15 troops, but they'll be trash troops. That's the problem. Uh, defensive, demagogue. Uh, yeah, this guy's better. Let's go for him. And you are who we are going to mobilize. And put on this front. How much infamy was that? Six infamy. This is the thing. This is, this is just a bit annoying with... Uh, Native uprisings, because the infamy you get seems so much more than you really should. 
Okay, human rights might be good. Psychoanalysis would also be good, but nine years. Now, let's have a look back over here at malaria prevention. Nine years. I mean, it's a long time. Oh, it's, it's, it's too long, I think. Triage, rifling, enlistment offices, electric telegraph. Don't want any mil uh, naval one. That doesn't really help. Reinforced concrete. Yeah, let's do that. Plus 15% building throughput. That sounds great. Constructing some motor, then some furniture, ports, then steel mills. The munition plants, okay, that's fine. The ports won't take long to build. Then we're doing the steel mills, the tooling workshops, and then the loaded textile mills. Okay, nitroglycerin's done, but we don't really need it too much. District of Columbia. It's mainly Dixie, so... Yeah, make them make more Dixie loyalists, please. Redeemers. It, yeah, more Dixies. More happy Dixies. So that should hopefully... Hopefully that gets done, but if not, it's only 33 months, so... Then the reconstructed... Constru ah, I can't speak. The reconstruction is ended. Nowhere else has joined, and they won't, hopefully. Now that we have this area, yeah. How long for that? Oh, baby. Nice and quick. Oh, those ones are 2,400 days. These ones are because of the mal lack of malaria prevention. But we have got set up, and we will take Douala quite quickly. American South Cameroon. Are you building a port? Yes, you are. So we'll build another port here. We'll build one in the Congo as well. Another uprising. That's fine. Just annoying that it pr gives us extra infamy when we really could do without that right now. But it's these guys, so they're going to... They will be an easy target, as usual. And we will get this whole area then. Chile is a bit annoying taking like little slivers, but whatever. Not much we can do. We're going to be there soon. Yeah, war with Ute. It's going to be easy. <laughs> Poor guys. Yeah, it was just instant. Instantaneous stack wipes. Not that those are a thing in this game. More enactment success. Oh, baby. More loyalists. Thank you. Country is in the frenzy for war. Yeah, whatever. Oh, God. Go away, carpetbaggers. <laughs> really not that helpful. How's our colonization doing up here? I need to press that at some point. Not yet, though. We're nearly done all of Texas. Texas on 16. Could do with, could do with them uh, being a little bit happier. Could we do anything to make them happy? Start bankrolling. How much would we have to give them? Oh, 0.23. Oh. Yeah, let's do that. Sounds good. I'll make them happier. Well, this very much likes, like, looks like it's going to turn into war. Yeah, they've not backed down. So, get going, boys. We'll take that very quickly and easily. Wait, they're winning. Bro, they're borrowed troops. They've got good troops. What's going on there? We're winning on this front. How are they winning on this side? It's crazy. Oh, Texan statehood was completed. Welcome to America. Way, there's Texas. <laughs> yes. Fantastic. What's their population like? Oh, it's a, it's a real un Yamwezi, East African. Wow, got a lot of those. Comanche, that's Native American. Yankees. Udam, Udam. Uh, more American. That's African again. East African. So they've had a lot of uh, migration from East Africa. Cool. That's probably because of the discrimination that's going on in there. France have blocked off this, which is very interesting because 
That very much means that Britain doesn't have a foothold in East Africa. So that's going to be France's. And if we can build our foothold here, hopefully we can block the whole coast. And that'll be free reign for us. Let's see. Oh, it's taking a long time, but... The uh, malaria... Oh, we were going for reinforced concrete. I think definitely after this we'll go for malaria prevention. And then we can colonize properly over there. Okay. Republican Party won, so we should have good legitimacy. Not bothered about the armed forces being in the government. So that'll increase legitimacy quite a bit. Why can I not confirm that? Rural folk. Okay, rural folk. There you are. That makes our legitimacy very high. How are our institutions? Yeah, we need to get to that one, though. We can't even afford it anyway. Oh, this would be fantastic. So we need some more bureaucracy for that. So, for the end of the queue. I know it's 67 buildings long. <laughs> We're planning far ahead, guys. We're planning very far ahead. I'm going to build some over here. So that if we do manage to make these places very large and have a lot of population in them, we have the taxation capacity. Same down here as well, because we've obviously made these quite large. So that should help with the taxation quite a bit. Yeah, whatever. Like New York, how upset are you now? Are you in turmoil still? It's still a bit, but it's gone down. Shortage of lead. I know we're, we're trying to sort that out. <sighs> Clothes is just a constant issue. Everything else looks okay. Tools, we need a little bit more. Steel as well, though. Lead is a big issue. Everything else, pretty decent. Where's our coal? Yeah, we've got a surplus of coal. That's fantastic. Um, what else have we got here? Small arms. Yeah, we'll be all right. Wood. Mm, it's predominantly just cloves. Cloves is a nightmare. So any... Sure, there's no one we can import good clothes from. Surely. <laughs> like, 15... Yeah, I need Britain to, like, sell me some clothes. Like, a lot of clothes. How close do we are this? 53 out of 62. Ooh. Yes, university, please. Ha. So we got up to 53, but because we've got more states now. <laughs> we're just building too... we got too many states. Never. Yeah, we won against Mapuche. Oops. Yeah, the Kissy people, West African, starting to go to Colorado. Where? Okay, Colorado. Yep. See, this is this is why it's so good, <laughs> multiculturalism, guys, because you become the target for a lot of these. Look at that, 196,000 are gonna come. Pretty much, absolutely, absolutely double this population at least. A lot of Irish people here as well. Good. Hello, Irish people. Afro-American people are going to Wisconsin. Uh... Yeah, let's go for that. That's definitely better. Better option. Fantastic. Right then. Low market access. Virginia. Let's build a railway there. So let's sort all these low market accesses out. Uh, railway in Colorado. Uh, American Namarkaland. Yeah, we're, we're building. I think the rest of these, yeah, we've already got sorted. Yep, we'll be fine. Two million radicals now. That's decent. And, um, sorry, loyalists and radicals are going down. Oh, we're so close to this. It's only 21 mo one months left, but uh, it's not much we can do, is that? Building-wise, let's have a look. Yeah, we're building more textile. Oh, no, that's the wrong page. Yeah, those ports will get done. Then steel mills. Munition plants are not really that necessary right now, so I'm going to cancel them. Shipyards, I'll take the shipyards. More ports for market access. That's fine. Then we go with the lead mines. Then more steel mills, a gold mine, and then tooling workshops, then a load of textile plants. And some government administration. Yeah, I know it's going to take a while, but it'll be fine. 
Yeah, keep them happy. We're back to making money now again. Good. 55 of 63. It's so annoying that it's so close. Ooh, what has uh, France gone for here? Oh, wait, you literally just want to open the Ashanti market. Really? That is shocking, France. That is a terrible war goal. <laughs> At least try and conquer that place. Uh, what is the problem with our colonization over here? Is it the malaria? It's just normal malaria. I think it's because it's the desert. Really don't like colonizing in the desert, do we? Colonizing really fast over here now, which is fantastic. Over here as well, really fast in uh, South Cameroon. So hopefully we can go on to Dar al Kuti. We'll also finish the Niger Delta is normally a very, very good province. 1.54 million population, guys. That is fantastic. Danes have got this, though, which is very annoying. Go away, Denmark. Um... And eventually, I want to be able to take all this land. Potentially puppeting it, but... We're back down to being reputable. So, uh, reputable. So... Do we go for Mexico again? Or do we... I would like to clean up these borders. Like, potentially taking these, like, four states. And these, obviously, these states as well. We'll leave it a little bit. I want to stabilize our country first. I want to... I want the reconstruction to trigger first. So 15 more months. It's not too long. It's not too long to wait. Uh, get our building going. Look, our economy is absolutely skyrocketing right now. Loyalists are going up. Oh, fantastic. Standard of living is great. Clothes are a major issue still. Lead is an issue. Iron's gone back to being an issue when it was fine before, I think. So let us expand our iron mines as well. Uh, go for Pennsylvania. Go for Baiho. Hmm. Connecticut, there's not enough people. New York, we have no peasants. Hopefully we get some migration there then. Pennsylvania. New York, what a nightmare. Never had that either. So, it looks like pretty much all these buildings are... Yeah, this one. Munition plants are unable to fully hire, but everywhere else is. It's kind of good, though. You want it to be no peasants. You don't want there to be any peasants, but it's slightly... It's also slightly annoying, obviously. Go for patent stills. Get more liquor? No, I, I doubt that's not good. Um... Uh, yeah... Hmm... Who do I want to make happy? Just wait a second. What are the trade unions saying? They're minus three. Rural folk are happy. And industrialists. Pretty happy. I want them to be over ten, though. So let's keep up with that. Uh, now, what was I doing over here? I can't remember now. That's the problem. Let's... Yeah, I don't want precision tools. We don't have the silk for this. So that's fine. Steel mills. Go for the Bessemer process. Yep. Yeah, it was arms industries, wasn't it? Yep, let's go for rifles. Uses more tools and steels. But unfortunate. Oh, well. Tools and steels, yes. Very good words. Goddamn carpetbaggers everywhere, bro. Everywhere. <laughs> ah. Ah. But doesn't this look nice? <laughs> Doesn't this look lovely down here now? That's very nice. And, uh, yeah, we'll take the rest. Chili's a bit annoying with their little dots, but oh well. Yeah, hopefully we can block off this coast so France and Britain can't uh, join the party. But that is hugely, hugely unlikely. Also, up here, if we can get up to Messina, that'll be good. France looks like they're going to block us off with Kong. If we can kind of come this way. Also, Futa Jolon needs to uh, needs to make way for America, bro. Yeah, let's get there. That means we can colonize into this area. Ah, dedicated police force. That should really help with our radicals. Yeah, surely. Surely the radicals are going to go down. 
I don't know. Isolated state regions. Yeah, we know. We're trying to fix that. We're building ports soon. We're building ports soon, guys. <laughs> Just trying to keep up with the construction. That's a big problem. Chemical bleaching. And go for paper bleaching. I'll go for that. I don't think we'll go for the China, though. Not yet, anyway. Um, yeah. Paper bleaching. Less laborers. So, poor laborers. I'm sorry, guys. But, makes more paper. So, what, what can you say? Because ah, we've taken places, this always resets. So, tools. Yeah, always the tools. Could go for the nitroglycerin. Does make more coal. So, yeah, I go for the nitroglycerin on that. And, yeah, we'll leave it at that. Brazil wants a trade agreement. Do you know what, Brazil? Fine, I'll take it. I mean, I'm, I'm not really that interested in you right now. Oh, City of Plenty. Fantastic. God damn, people of Louisiana, do what you want. Grant independence, no. Why hasn't that completed? Is that a bug? Hmm. 56 out of 63. It's just so annoying that we're not going to be able to complete that. Any states to incorporate? Oh, yes. Lots. Lots of states. Also start incorporating these bad boys down here. You can see 222 for the Niger Delta because there's a massive amount of population that's down there. Then, oh, have we... Uh, yeah, we've got no more institutions that we're supporting, so that's fine. Or trying to get, should I say. A loyal state government, whatever. Just pressing the top one every time on this now. Yep, we're colonizing there. Oh, can we not colonize up here yet? What's going on? Senegal. Do it. What is the colonization status down here? So where? Yeah, we're colonizing little spots. Futa Jalon's in the way. That is annoying, but. Yeah, we are colonizing up north. We're also colonizing towards Futa Jalon, which will be great. Still taking ages over here. And we are still, at the minute, touch wood. The only people colonizing on the sort of mid-Africa west coast. And the Congo base. Obviously, Portugal has a lot, but they already start with that. Yeah, fund the journal. You can see our budget going all over the place right now. But don't be scared of having negative budget. It really doesn't matter that much. As long as you don't go into the red and you're, and you're costing yourself money. While you're still on that gold bar, your reserves are still good. Damn revolution brewing again. Bro, how? Can I reform the government to get rid of that? Everyone's angry, bro. Oh, God damn. Let me get the petty bourgeois in there. Why? What? The southern planters, they are. They've come back to power, haven't they? Oh. Um. Oh, God damn, bro. Another revolution. <laughs> I mean, we will win this one again. Get Britain on our side again. Goddamn fools. They can win. They, they tried last time and lost. Does that mean we have to incorporate those states again? Four days until the reconstruction is done, though. Come on. Let's go. That should... Okay, that's not really helped with this, has it? <laughs> this has just come out of nowhere. I know they're upset, but they're only on minus 11. That's not even that... Evangelicals are pretty up upset, but there's not many of them. Everyone else is pretty happy. Surely this is going to... Yeah, 
That's got to tick down, hasn't it? God damn fools, bro. God damn fools think they can have this sort of revolution. Building wise, yeah, we're expanding a, a railway. A defensive pact with Brazil. Okay, I will accept that because I don't, I don't really want Brazil's land right now. It'll also mean them very unlikely to join any wars if I want to puppet Chile and Argentina, for example, which I will at some point. Uh, maybe not quite yet. Let's have a look at our buildings then. Lead mines now, then steel mills. Not many lead nut mines though, is it? How much lead are we lacking? We're lacking a lot. What do these lead mines... How much do you build? Plus 120. I mean, it should be enough. Clothes are just a, a, a joke, really. Lead's a joke. Um, iron as well. We need more. Dye. Dye is a big problem. Uh, I think that's a, yeah, dye plantations. Good job we've taken this land down here, eh? Um, where should we go for? I think we go for Veracruz. Six of those. That'll be good. Then, what else was that? We're willing to get some more fabric. Ten more in North Carolina. And also, potentially, we are getting more iron, so that's fine. I'm going to get some sulfur as well. Just for our explosives expansion soon. Uh, Virginia, 76. Am I building something here to help that? No. Oh, we are building. We're building a railway, but a long way away. <laughs> it's going to be a while before we get to that. That was a revolution. Minus one a week. Okay, that's good. So, we completed the reconstruction. Branching out. Yeah, I don't want the rail railway thingy. Not yet. Uh, we'll complete if any American building is a steel mill. Building level is greater than or equal to four. Occupancy is 90% and it's not subsidized. Hmm. Okay. Law enforcement level five. I could swear that that law, by making that institution stronger, does that doesn't make the planters more important anymore. Patagonian people are going to Illinois. Good. Yes. Migration targets are, fanta uh, are fantastic. Iron is expensive. That's fine. Yep, Dakota's going to Texas. Isolated state regions, yeah, they, they won't be uh, they won't be isolated for too much longer. It's great. So yeah, we're still going okay down here. Yeah, we're going really fast in this area, aren't we? Okay, they've launched a native uprising against us. No problem whatsoever. The only problem comes if someone joins their side, then we back down. See. A lot of countries are invo invested and interested over here. That's the problem, you see. How's our infamy? It's only at two. So, I think next episode we will declare war on uh, Mexico once again. And clean up these borders. Take this corner. And potentially take a little bit more all the way down to here, maybe. So, we finally got these borders. And there are, I believe there are gold fields that spawn in California. There's already gold fields in Nevada. A le size 11 as well. There's gold fields in Arizona as well. So really something we want to take. Um, what about over here? Durango. Iron. Sinaloa. Yeah, no gold there. Zacatas. Yeah, it does have gold mines. Jalisco. There's also gold up this way as well. Revolutionary Bolivia? Well, there's no revolution happening here anymore, which is great. And we've just got to be careful here. Don't want to be at war with one of the big boys yet. <laughs> or at all, really. As America, it doesn't really... It doesn't really help us if we're ever at war with the big boys. Uh, is there any more colonies we can do? No. 
clearly not. Fortunate. Have we cleaned up down here now as well? Yeah, we have. Chili just took that little dot as well. God damn, Chili. <laughs> God damn it, bro. God damn it, Chili. Yep. They might back down. Very unlikely, though. No one has joined their side or even con contemplating it at the minute. They can dive in last minute, though, sometimes, which is a bit annoying. But oh well. Are we past that law? Do we want to pass any more laws? I don't think there's anything we really want right now. Definitely we don't want migration controls. We want free migration. Propertied women might be quite good, but the, the planters are, are not something we really want. Could do that. Takes the planters up to zero. Makes the intelligentsia a bit upset. Hmm... I'm not bolstering or, or getting rid of anything right now. So having rights to assembly doesn't really help me. Because I'm not suppressing or bolstering any of the interest groups at the minute. Um, this is just worse, honestly. This is just worse. The tech spread's good, but... It's just worse. So I'm willing to do that. Make everyone happy. Stop a revolution from happening again. <laughs> God damn it. That was close. That was close. Mandinka uprising. Oh, it's these guys. Oh, that's getting us more infamy, bro. So, let's mobilize. Defend and advance. And we'll be fine. Uh, this one's going to go to war, it looks like. Reinforced concrete. More... Quicker building, yeah. War has broken out. Uh, we should just smash them straight very quickly. Yeah, it should be nice and easy. Whoa, 63 defense. They got more borrowed troops. Hmm. They have regulars and stuff. It's crazy. Look, 63 defense. That's crazy. Pretty good. Ah, oh, we just took it straight away. <laughs> oh, well. Well, then, guys, I think that's going to be it for today. So thank you very much for watching. It's been a pleasure, as always. Please do like and subscribe. It really does help the channel out. And I will see you all again on the next video.